We're here at AQS Quilt Week for the Fall Paducah Show, and I have another winner, Janet Cochran from Fort Collins, Colorado, and you won second place in the Large Quilts, Quilter's Choice category that's sponsored by Statler by Gamel. Congratulations. Thank you very much. And what a beautiful quilt. Thank you. It was always my goal to someday win a ribbon at Paducah. This is my third attempt, and it, and it worked. Well, just <laughs> try, try again, right? Um, yeah. <laughs> You have to figure out what works. Yes. Well, let's talk about your beautiful quilt because you've done a lot of beautiful applique on this quilt. Um, tell us where the patterns came from and then how you put this whole thing together because you've got borders and more borders and more borders. So the center medallion was my design. Um, a lot of the old English medallions had big flower baskets, little baskets. So I love flowers, I love birds. And then, um, I love English paper piecing, so of course I stuck that in. Um, Cindy Hamilton inspired this border right here. And then Gina Kimball was the final outer border flowers. And then I kind of modified those as I looked at all the other applique artists that are out there um, inspired me. And then I had to finish with more English paper piecing. Well, and so I ask you, how many hexagons did you put in this quilt? And you don't know the final number, but how many are just in that border that you had to add on? I was going to say there's over 2,000 in the final border that's up across, so there's many. And the quilting certainly enhances your quilt, and it was quilted by? Um, Paige Johnson out of Minnesota. And I just had, I commented to you because one of the things that sometimes people don't do is that they don't quilt on the individual petal pieces or even on the center, and how well that secures it, but it also adds lots of dimension. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she did a beautiful job. Um, I had to make her very anal in that I wanted her to change colors. I <laughs> wanted the dimension, but I didn't want to contrasty, so I made her a little crazy. She had to change to pinks, to greens, to browns, so that it would be the way I wanted, but she did a good job. Well, it's a beautiful quilt, and so do you have plans for your prize winnings? I'm going to Indonesia in a week and a half, so oh. I've got spending money. That's right, you sure do. So maybe pick up some batiks in Indonesia, and I'll, I'll be fine. All right. If not, I have another quilt that needs quilted, and <laughs> that's going to eat half of it. So. Okay. Well, congratulations again. Thank you very um, much. Now that you know the formula of getting a quilt in the show and winning a prize, we hope we'll see more entries from you. I will do my best. Okay, and we hope that we'll see entries from you at a future AQS Quilt Week. And I hope that you will enter an AQS Quilt Week, and we'll see you at an AQS Quilt Week soon.